think uh, Jet and, uh, Jeanette and I are, are both rather sorry to be leaving this place. It's been a fantastic couple of months. But, uh, oh, here's a really large garfish. I hope you can see this. If you didn't see that, too bad, I saw it. Um, yeah, obviously got to go back to the States now before the cyclone season hits here. And uh, the weather's already starting to show signs of hot, steamy, summery, tropical kind of stuff. There's uh, absolutely no wind yet again. We've got about another 11 hours of motoring in this before we get to the Gulf Stream, and then there'll be about another 12 hours of motoring, or hopefully sailing, which will be the night time, um, across to the US. And I'll just show you what the surroundings look like. You may be able to see there's an awful lot of um, thunder and uh, cloud activity happening over there. There's a, a couple of large thunderheads that have been sitting there for two days now, not moving, uh, just getting bigger and smaller and bigger and smaller. There's uh, no sign of any wind on the water. And over there, there's some more thundercloud activity, there's a lot of that around, and the the water depth here is about 15 feet, we're motoring at about 4 knots just to conserve uh, fuel, but uh, the clarity is, is phenomenal. I'm, I'm just sitting on the, uh, up on the foredeck, watching for fish basically, but I'll see if I can show you what it is that I can see in terms of the bottom of the water, 15 feet below. Hoping you can see that because it's uh, it is incredibly clear. Um, I've sat here and I've watched numerous fish go from side to side. We're trailing a line, but so far they've all been able to successfully avoid it. Rotten bastards! But uh, there you go. It doesn't really matter that much. We've got an, enough supplies of spam. And anyway, now let's go and have a little bit of a look around at what else we can see if there's anything. my reflection in the, on the bottom of the ocean there, waving, hello Neil, hello people, and there's Jeanette taking a photo, I'll try and stagger my way back now. There's Jeanette, still nothing doing, oh look at that, Jeanette's half naked, oh who would have thought? <laughs> as Jeanette getting dressed and here we are back at the nerve station which fortunately is in the, in the shade because the temperature hasn't dropped below about 32 degrees in the last few days anyway, that's it for me bye